everyone, today I have a haul to share with you all. This isn't just any old haul, I am sharing with you my autumn picks, including Halloween items from our favourite shop, Poundland. And I've done a shop with me for Halloween in Poundland, so I will link that up here for you if you want to check that out. And this video is also part of a challenge. We were asked to create a full vignette or to share a haul. And seeing as I have created a full vignette before, I decided to share a haul with you all. Here's my full vignette that I have created a few weeks back, so you can go ahead and check that out. This challenge is hosted by Pretty Simple Sherry and Inspired Living with Christy. For the rest of the video, I'm going to be showing you my autumn picks that I've got from eBay, as well as, of course, my Halloween haul from Poundland. Starting off with our Poundland items, I have picked up this orange glittery pumpkin. It also lights up, and I think that's a pretty good deal for a pound. They did have these in other colours as well, so I picked up two orange ones here. And I also picked up a black one. I think it does have a third colour, but I didn't pick it up. I think it is purple. Correct me if I'm wrong, if you have seen them. So yeah, you just remove this. And they light up and the colours change. So it's not just one colour. I've also picked up these tights. And they've got different colours and designs. So they've got like a spiderweb one. And then they've got different coloured stripes. And I went for the purple and black. I'm going to be using these for a DIY and I also picked up these fishnet tights. The next item I've got is this cute witch. It's a solar wobbler so you can put it in your car and it just wobbles. And again they've got different designs in this so I also picked up the cat in the pumpkin. I'm a cat lover, I'm an animal lover so I definitely had to get this one. And again I'm going to be using these in some DIYs. And I also got this sparkly light up candle. I really did like this. Again you just remove that and there you go it turns on. I've also picked up this witch. They had different designs so they've got like um, ghosts and a few other characters and it's a motion sensor. I can't believe this stuff is for a pound. It screams when activated so you remove that and then there's an off and on button there but I'm really kind of scared to try it out. I don't know how loud it screams, so yeah, I'm not going to be doing that. But I actually didn't buy it for the sensor thing because, like I said, all of this will be in a DIY. So I just bought it for the witch. And this is also one of my favourite things. I'm probably going to use this in a DIY a few times because I've got quite a few ideas for it. It's a bird cage. Again, it was a pound. And... Yeah, you open it up, you can do whatever you want in there. And I also picked up two of these, that's how good they are. I was so surprised that they're selling this for a pound. I mean, seriously, even this here, the ones that you can find for bottles, is quite difficult to find for a pound. And, you know, you can take this out, you can use a skull for something, use a fairy lights for something else. So definitely you can't go wrong with these for a pound. So that's my Poundland Halloween items that I've picked out. And if you want to see what I'm going to be doing with them all, make sure you are subscribed to my channel. Now I am moving on to the things that I've got from eBay for autumn. And I'm starting off with this bag here. I got these and they're actually dried fruit. I can't remember what they're called, so if you know, let me know in the comments. But basically, they look like miniature pumpkins, as you can see. And I've never seen anything like it. I don't even know how I came across it on eBay, but I definitely just had to buy them. Of course, they were pretty cheap as well. And they come in different colours, so I selected this colour. I don't know if they're painted. They look like they're painted over but they are actually dried fruit so yeah i mean these are super super cute i actually brought a lot of dried fruit so these are some more and they they actually smell really sweet and nice <laughs> you can actually do this process yourself so you don't actually have to buy them but i don't even know what these are called either yeah but they they look like pumpkins and that's why i brought them <laughs> 
and this fox here I've got some wooden embellishments I've been looking around for a fox for so long and this is the closest that I could get to them and I actually selected the wrong size so I've got some bigger ones and I had to go back and purchase some smaller ones and they give you some free hearts with them as well but I've got a ton of these hearts so I didn't actually need those either but I'm probably going to be doing a giveaway with these actually turn them into necklaces and such so yeah if you like giveaways I do that a lot on my channel so you can subscribe if you'd like a chance to win and I also got this it's just so beautiful another wooden embellishment kind of thing and I'm going to turn this into a scenery I'm actually probably going to try using this as well for something just to make use of my money some more wooden embellishments here I actually got these ones from China so they were really cheap they come in a pack of autumny things so you've got a squirrel you've got acorns you've got leaves you've got mushrooms here i think this is a really nice selection you've also got this cute hedgehog some more dried fruit here so i've got some oranges and these smell really nice and then i have this pack of artificial vegetables for autumn and let me tell you these smell really really horrible <laughs> i think they look pretty realistic though got some pumpkins as well and I brought some ribbons I've actually used these already they're like garlands for autumn so I've got some in pumpkins for Halloween and then I've got some brown leaves and gold ones they're so soft they're like satin these are some beautiful berries in the orangey red and yellowy colors I've also picked up two bags of these from eBay they are brown sand mixed with glitter and I bought these for a zen garden that I wanted to create for autumn. And I picked up these artificial plants in the orange colour. You get three in a bunch. So you did get quite a lot for your money. But I have to say I really was disappointed with them. The quality is really bad and you can tell from a mile away that they are artificial. I don't know, hopefully I can find something to do with them and make them look a little better than they are. I also got another bag of artificial fruits, vegetables, again some more pumpkins. And I also brought this when it arrived, it looked like a broomstick that I've ordered and it looked like I was a student from like Hogwarts or something. I think the postman was probably a bit baffled as to what was in there. But yeah, I got this again for autumn DIYs. And lastly, I bought two packs of stickers. They've all got different designs, but they are, again, woodland, watermy kind of stickers. So you've got some owls, you've got rabbits, you've got squirrels, and I do have another design, but I just can't find it. So that's it for my eBay and Poundland Halloween Autumn Haul. I hope that you guys have enjoyed watching and that you can't wait to see what I'm going to be making with all of this. If you're new to my channel, I would love for you to stick around. So I hope that you can click that subscribe button and become part of the family. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Love you all. Take care of yourselves. Bye.